This right here, this is Adi. He's a German Shepherd Lab Great Pyrenees mix. He's a good boy, he's a great dog, and he sheds a little bit. Right now, I'm gonna show you how the Bissell Crosswave Pet Pro shows up or stands up to pet hair. First thing I need to do is I need to get a little bit of pet hair. So, I've got my brush here, we're gonna get you brushed, and we're gonna get some pet hair for our demonstration. We have our sample here. Now this is an exaggerated amount of pet hair. Typically don't have this much hair just laying around. Now the Bissell Crosswave Pet Pro boasts that it is both wet and dry and multi-surface. So we're gonna leave a little bit here on the carpet. We're gonna get a little bit here on the hardwood floor and we are going to put it to the test and see how it does. I'm just going to do a dry vacuum over the hair, see how it does. Like butter. Wow, just like that, easy peasy. Now that we've picked up all the hair, if you wanted to clean the surface, if this was around his bowl or area where he was eating, I could go ahead and then you turn on the hardwood floor setting, pull the trigger and then wash the floor. That's a good boy. Now the last thing to test is the actual bristle here. So if I look at the agitator, one of the big things that you want to worry about is does it get full of hair? And actually, this looks really clean. There's not a bunch of his hair still stuck to the actual brush. So that means that it's actually been picked up into the machine. So as you can see, all that hair was picked up into the actual dust bin or the dirty reservoir. And that means that you can then dump it out and get rid of it. And it's not actually just stuck in the bristle of the machine. So that actually is very cool. So there you have it. That is how the Bissell Crossway Pet Pro stands up to dog hair. Now, in my opinion, that was an exaggerated amount of pet hair. Usually we don't have that much laying around, but it does very well. I am very impressed with it, highly recommended. If you want to see exactly how to use the machine from top to bottom, I have a tutorial about that. I will link to that video as well. I wanna say thank you, Audie, for being such a good boy and being our um, support today to help us make this video. Again, my name is Drew Smith. If you like DIY, anything to do with cleaning a house, taking care of a house, doing a little bit of projects around the house, please feel free to check out some of my other videos. If you like what you see, please feel free to like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Oh, you want to get more treats, huh?